I think they can see you, you don't mind? Oh, okay. Let me see where I can put y'all. Anyway, I'm gonna try to drive with y'all like this. All right, so I'm headed to <laughs> Walmart, probably Trader Joe's. Just over to my area, trying to get ready for the week, you guys, because y'all know how we gotta get ready for the week. Okay, so you guys, while she's pouring me some water, I gotta tell y'all the good news. Okay, so, I went to the doctor Friday. No, for, I don't know why I didn't tell y'all this Friday. Well, before I went to the doctor, my um, diabetic doctor called me on Friday. And remember I told you guys I was on, okay, let me just do this real quick. I was on 30 units when I first came out of the hospital. And then about two weeks later, um, they looked at my readings for my blood sugar, brought me down to 22 units. And then um, two weeks later, they looked at my blood sugar again and liked what they were seeing, brought me down to 15 units, wasn't it? I think it was. 15 units, okay. And then maybe about a few weeks later, they liked what they saw again and brought me down from 15 to seven units. Okay, you guys. So then she called me, well, I did that for about seven units for about two weeks. Then she called me again, checked my readings of my blood sugar, and brought me down to seven units. Okay, did I just say that? Did I say seven? seven. Yeah, okay, seven. Then she did it again, and then they brought me down to four units, the doctor did. Okay, you guys, so I had a doctor's appointment two weeks ago, and um, but my uh, diabetic doctor called me. Everything was well with that, with the uh, doctor's appointment. Then my diabetic doctor called me again, this Friday and she looked at my readings and she was like oh my gosh I don't know what you're doing but you need to continue doing what you're doing she was like this is incredible do you guys know what she did she took me off of insulin so I am not on insulin you guys God is so good as I was so excited she was like do you understand what this means you're not on insulin anymore she was like, so we're going to see how you do. She said, I just don't want you taking any insulin. I just want to see how you do. She said, and I have a doctor's appointment this Friday coming up. She said, and that's perfect timing because then doctor, your doctor, Dr. Jane can really see where you're at as far as you being off of the insulin, how good you did for the week. So you guys, so far, my sugar counts have been fantastic since she took me off on Friday. And um, I... I'm just amazed. The only thing that I have to get rid of is this little cough, but I'm not, they took pictures of my lungs on Friday. I went to the doctor because I didn't feel good and I was not playing. I said, I do not want pneumonia, I don't want anything. So they said, well, you did good to come back in just to check. So they gave me a Z pack. I don't know what that thing is called, but I haven't taken it yet. Cause he said, take it unless you really see necessary that you need to. And they gave me some cough medicine. And uh, I take that at night. But um, I haven't taken the z pack yet because it doesn't seem like I need it. But you guys, they said if we call you this weekend, then you're going to need to come in and pick up two antibiotics. That means you're in, you're in, you have um, an infection. But they did not call me this week. So guess what? I am a happy camper. So you guys, we're going to head up. So that's the good news. That is the good news. How can I pass that up? That is the good news. So I'm very happy I'm not on insulin anymore. So I went from 30 units to no units. And so I give God all the praise and glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, for that. And um, those are for you, those of you who have been praying for me and have been supportive of me since I've had this diabetes sickness and everything. I want to say thank you for your prayers and for your support. And I just want to give you an update on, um, on how I'm doing. So thank you. All right. I need to Costco. This is the cutest little patio set. For $2,199. Very, very cute. And that gazebo is really cute too. Really, really cute. Isn't this cute? It's very light though. Oh, this one swerves around. Now you like that? Mm -hmm. It's cute, huh? Not that I can get any of that. That's cute though, huh? That is cute. Is that the one with coconut? 
Mm. Oh no, that's not the one. Oh, that's a nice little Easter. That assortment. Mm -hmm. Not cute. Mmm. I love this brand, the Monte Jardin. It's really soft. And that gray one's pretty too, huh? Mm. Okay, let's get some. Ooh, going in the fridge. Lord have mercy. Oh my goodness. Okay, where's the organic blueberries? Ooh. Organic blueberries. Are they organic? No. Are they here? I don't know. Are they are those are here? No. Oh, these are the organic blueberries. Ma, which one do you want? This one look good? Yeah? It's turkey spinach lasagna and it is so good. Okay. Okay, what else do we need again? Uh, what? Yeah. Oh, we won't be getting those. I can't Tortinos? Oh, yeah. Pizza rolls? You find my stuff I gave you when you... Oh, oh yeah. That, from I'm talking about that pesto pizza look good. Huh? They got some veggie burgers here too, but they don't look good. See, this one seems like it's open. Here we go. Okay, you guys, so we just made it back. And y'all see my glasses. I'm telling y'all, these glasses just always have me look like I'm sweating. Just came back out from Costco, and now we're headed over to, where is that? Walmart and Trader Joe's and we will be done. You guys, the worst time to go to Costco is on Sunday evening. It was so many people in there. I'm just like, forget it. I'll come back and get the rest of the stuff later. It's just way too much. Um, I know. But it looks like rain is in the air a little bit more. So I'm real happy about that. Just came out of Bath and Body Works, you guys. And if you have the app and they don't send these coupons to you, but you have the app, guess what? These coupons are on the app. And you don't have to have them in the mail. So you guys, make sure you download the app. I went inside Bath and Body Works. Got a little tiny haul I'm going to show you just with this in video because I've just been out and about. But y'all, I have got to show you this really quick. This guava, let me turn this on. Maybe y'all can see me a little bit with the light. This guava hand cream, I... This stuff is ridiculously fantastic. I got this item for free because I had up to um, a $5 a item up to $6 for free. And these were four bucks, so I went head on and just got this. And I have the cutest um, candle holder, you guys. I gotta show you that. Y'all, it's pineapple, my mom. Well, Delia, who's the girl who works in Bath and Body Works, she showed me, she's fantastic, I love her. But you guys, I'm gonna show you that soon. So we're headed into Target. And so let's see what we see inside. You guys, look at these plates. These are really pretty. Oh, they're little bunny plates. Oh, let me see the green one. That is so pretty. And I love that beautiful pink. That's really pretty. And those little mugs are cute. Happy Easter. These are cute too. Oh, that's a pretty cup. And saucer. Ma, you see this? You know I love that. Isn't that like cute? Yeah, I see it. Just that. See how much that is at the bottom? And that's where the Easter egg. It's, so it's so pretty. I'm gonna get it. Let me get this for my mommy. Make sure it's a perfect one. <laughs> uh-oh, look what me and mommy just got. Oh, this tray is pretty. 
Oh, that's not even going. Oh, what you calling? That's really cute. Oh, that is really a pretty lamp. Isn't that retro-y pretty? Mm -hmm. I love that. That's really, really pretty. Oh, they have so much candy. August what? Okay, put it in there. Oh, this is a coconut. Oh my gosh. These little people Oreo cookies are so cute. Y'all, that is so simple. No, we won't be getting that. Oh, how cute are these, mommy? You see those napkins? Look at those. Pretty. The little napkins that are up front. How much are those? They're long ones, huh? Yeah. Let me see. Mm -hmm. These are really pretty. I love napkins. It's cute, but the ones up front. Oh, that Easter basket is cute. Look at that Easter basket. I want to show this little Easter basket. It's so cute. Isn't that one cute? Oh, God, I need you to get married and give me a grandbaby. Well, don't just marry anything, honey. Hold up now. I ain't that desperate. Ooh, let me see this one. This is really, really cute. Isn't that cute? Yes. I think you can feel it. Sure. But can I? Behind you. No, wait. First, I want you to see how disgusting this is. Like, who in the heck wants hairy Easter eggs? Hairy. Like, what in the world? Do they turn into creatures or what? That's a bit disturbing. Oh, these are so pretty. And look at this. That's beautiful. Isn't that pretty? Oh, a Mickey lover would love this. This is so pretty. And the cross, I love the cross. Yeah, I'm a little scared of the Easter egg. That is hairy. I'm a little frightened of that. And that's the go with all the little lambs are so cute. Oh, that is hilarious. That is definitely a princess basket. Isn't that pretty? The little unicorn basket, that's too much. Is this really a, yeah. That is a princess basket. Isn't that pretty? No. You don't like it? There you go. Mama, y'all. I told y'all, mama be doing some weird stuff I like sometimes. It. I don't get that. Okay, you guys, so I made it back home. And I want to show you my really quick haul that I got from Sprouts, Target. Um, where else do we go? Sprouts, Target, uh, Costco, and I stopped by Bath and Body Works. Okay, you guys? So, let's get started here. This is the turkey spinach lasagna. You guys, this is so fantastic this is the best lasagna mommy and i love when we make this it lasts us the whole week you guys it is it's by frankly fresh and we did get it from costco it is so good and it's turkey um and spinach and that's what i love about it so much and yes yeah, so this is 310 calories um 19 grams of protein, but you're not eating that much. So that's what's so good about it. You're just eating just a, uh, um, the palm of your hand size. And so, you guys, please, if you see this in your local um, Costco, you guys try this out. It is so delicious. So we did get some broccoli florets. You guys, I love my broccoli. So we got that from Costco today. Um, we also got some Kerrygold butter. Um, the best butter. Love Kerrygold butter. Um, we also bought two containers of packages of um, the organic blueberries. Yeah, two of the packages of that. Um, usually I don't cook, but sometimes when we want a burger or something, um, he can have these. But another thing that's good, you guys, I usually eat turkey burgers. Or now I'm doing um, veggie burgers. I'm looking for a really good veggie burger. I did buy some the other day. But do a lettuce wrap. It is so delicious when you do the lettuce and tomato and, you know, the onion and all that. And you just don't have the bread. It's just a lettuce wrap. But, um, of course, um, try to, I'm going to try to get him to do that. But I know he's not going to do it. But anyway, so, yeah, we got this one. This is the Kirkland Ground Sirloin. Um, uh, one, um, third pound and it is, uh, how many of these come in here? I think it's 18 of them. 
yeah i believe it's 18 of them that come in and my son loves and my mother both love the organic um chicken legs so i put these in the slow cooker with some onion bell pepper and um um, onion, bell pepper, and um, all the different nice herbs and some spices. And it comes out really, really delicious in the slow cooker. My family loves those. So, yeah, I'm going to be making those this week. Some point in time, I'm going to put them on and let them slow cook for about a good four hours. So, I did get some salmon. And I'm going to cut that up and portion that off. Okay, so that's everything that I got from Costco. To these Belgian waffles, whole grain. We also got... Well, my son requested <laughs> this um, chocolate milk. I have no idea why he wanted this, but uh, yeah. So this is by a very good company, and they have the best eggnog. Um, but yeah, so he got this chocolate milk today. Um, I got some um, cranberry, just cranberry juice because I like to make sure that my kidneys are clean everything is doing pretty good and you guys it's only nine grams of uh, sugar that's in this and I would only probably just drink a cup full and this is all that goes in it's cranberry juice concentrate filtered water okay you guys so this is everything that I got from Target tonight I didn't um, get too much uh, from Target this teacup and saucer is that not the prettiest teacup and saucer ever I love that it has the gold trim and um, all the way around the cup even on the handle it is just so darling and she loves teacups and saucers and she's been looking at this for a long time and I said I'm gonna go and get this woman this teacup and saucer she can add it to the collections that I've been buying her all throughout the years but you guys this was so cute and it was only $6.99 $6.99 so adorable Okay, the next thing I got, I'm looking for a really good eyeliner, and this is a liquid eyeliner, and um, it was on clearance, you guys, for $6.98. It was regular $9.99. Let me see. Focus, 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 focus. Oh, I don't know what's going on. Anyway, it was regular $9.99, and I got it for $6.98. You know, I can't have sugar, but I'm not going to sit up here and say that I've never, I'm never going to eat sugar. And I just believe these little tiny eggs are nice portion controls. And I've been doing really good and I've had little sweets here and there when I'm craving because I don't want to go crazy. So I did get this and me and my mother and my son, one, I, I wouldn't do one a day, but maybe like one on the weekend just for a little treat because that's what what i what i have been doing so anyway you guys so i did get these and these are for the family and i will be grabbing a couple a few of them so yeah that's the reese's peanut butter egg you guys and then i got this for my son um he loves these and it's easter so i was like you know what Shouldn't be getting him that, but yeah, he's, he's been doing pretty good. Got another package of these, you guys. Um, I bought some the other day. They were so cute. I had to get another pack. And I got this. This is so cute. Spring is here. Um, kitchen towels. And look, this matches that. Is, is that not the cutest kitchen towel in the world? And you guys, I mean, you know, not literally, but you guys, it was only three bucks. Yeah, three bucks. And this was one dollar for these napkins. And you guys, one of my favorite Amy's um, meals is the organic corn and tomato. And I do pretty good with these. Um, I usually take one. Um, I don't eat two. I usually make them and then I eat one. My mom eat one, um, eats one and then we have it with vegetables. And we do pretty good for dinner on some nights. And you guys, it is so delicious this is one of my favorite meals and then i got um some thomas english muffins that i can have with egg whites in the morning and these are whole grain 25 percent um of whole grain and it's 100 percent whole wheat and i love thomas english muffins so i did get some of those okay so next up oh i wanted to show you i got some albacore tuna i did make some tuna tonight with rosemary and dill a little bit of lemon and um mayo with the um um, olive oil 
Um, and it was really, really good. And I'm having that for lunch tomorrow. But I did get some more. Um, thinking I might make some tuna tacos this weekend. Um, as This week as well. Okay. And then last but not least. We have the Fairlife Milk. When I was taking my um, How to Live with Diabetes class. The teacher said that Fairlife is one of the best um, milks to... Um, buy and she told us to try it so this is lactose free because my mother you know has issues with that and it's uh really really good so i can't it's 13 grams of protein and it's 50 less 50 percent sugar because you know milk has sugar in it you guys that's crazy sugar is in everything so that is basically everything that i got tonight and i hope you guys enjoy this haul with me i really do hope you guys enjoy it. it's not really well it's a little hard but it's me going out and you guys actually you know seeing me going to the store and just showing instead of showing one thing one haul on one group one one store i just did went out today actually the last i believe the last three videos that i'm going to be putting up is basically like that me going out and getting things that i need and just showing you guys what i got when i saw a good deal on something i bought it so anyway, you guys, yes, I hope you enjoy. Now I got to go and do laundry um, before I get up and go to work tomorrow, y'all. And it's already late, you guys. And so thank you so much for watching Journey with Shar. If you like me, my channel, please um, like, subscribe, and share. Give me a thumbs up. Yes. Please like, subscribe, and share. And also hit that thumbs up button. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Remember, keep God first, trust Him, and He'll always lead you in the right direction. You guys stay tuned for more with Journey with Shar. And you guys have a blessed week. I'm praying that y'all have a super duper blessed week filled with health, blessings, and prosperity, y'all. But most of all, you trust in God, okay? Stay tuned. I'll see you soon. Love you. Bye-bye. Good night.